Hey folks, welcome. I'm a rough pebble and I'm really excited to be diving into some more Cosmeteer. Uh, it's a game I've covered in the past, but the most recent update has brought in some really interesting elements like the crew construction, which uh, means that your crew has to actually build out your ship versus it just being there. Um, I think that's going to be a lot of fun and I'm excited to check it out. I haven't had a chance to really see what it looks like. Um, I've just read some of the patch updates and I thought it looked fun. So let's go ahead and start a new game. We'll do career mode here. Um, I will do, yes, I think Admiral is good. That gives us take 25% more damage from enemies and deal 20% more damage. Um, sure. So a little bit more challenging. And then Architect. There's normal resource drop rates versus reduced drop rates. Let's go with Architect for now. Advanced game options, standard galaxy size, sure. Uh, crew fame ratio, I've got that set to scarce, so we'll have 33% fewer crew uh, resource uh, and will be available for higher depending on our fame, so I think that's fine. I say hold on to all of this, that's our galaxy seed, so if you're interested in playing the same galaxy that I'm playing, you can, uh, you can go ahead and find that there. I am going to start with a, hmm, a Model L. That could give us 5,000. Model C gives us a little bit more. We don't really start with a ton of weaponry in a Model S. Trade speed and offensive firepower for a defensive shield generator that can block incoming enemy fire. I kind of like the shield. Let's go with the Model S. Start a new game. All right, in we go. So here we can see our ship. Uh, we can go into build and repair. We can see what the inside of our ship looks like. So this game is really neat. It blends um, various elements of FTL and roguelikes and space exploration games. Um, really, really, really neat game. Um, we can see that these are the red shirts. This is a uh, one of the crews that has been sort of regenerated for us. It's one of the roles. Um, they are wearing the red shirts. Um, we could do some more building and repairing if we wanted to. Again, this is where the most recent update shines, I think. Um, we'll see what that looks like once we have a little bit more money, a little bit more resources. Um, yes, okay, thank you. Uh, we can just hide this tutorial. Um, flying our ship, yep. So you can just go ahead and, whoops, uh, that's that's not it. We can just sh click over here and it will move. And we can see that there are other ships here that are um, that are sending crew onto the orbital station here. Um, those crew are bringing in resources and whatnot. Um, our Model S ship, let's go ahead and have you this point defense platform. There's a few more out this way. We can zoom out uh, pretty far and we can see uh, a fair bit of the uh, the solar system here. And there's the, the star here, the local star, um, as well as some other orbit, uh, stations and planets and, and other bodies. Um, we can zoom out even further by going to here, to the galaxy map. Um, and we can do a ton of exploration out here. Uh, here we can see that this is the Monolith Cooperative, Centuri Imperium, the Ball of Soul. Um, we'll, we'll have an opportunity to see all of that and explore all of that here in, um, in due time. Now, the, uh, the game is just going. We can pause time. Um, we could go ahead and... We could go ahead and chat with you if we wanted to, so we can hail you using our hail button here, using our comms. Um, here we can see that there are a variety of missions and things for us to do. So let's go ahead and do a few fugitive bounties. So uh, a fugitive haywire class vessel is wanted for illegal activities within the Umpis system. Authorities from the Monolith Co Cooperative have posted a bounty of 2,500 credits to be paid to any Cosmeteer that can eliminate it. Um, so we'll try to go and eliminate the, um, the, the, uh, the, the 
fugitive over here. We can go ahead and zoom out here. And it's likely over in this direction. So let's go ahead and have ourselves fly out this way. We need to avoid um, this asteroid here. And we could ultimately mine that asteroid if we wanted to. So we can click on view and we can see that there um, are, what is this? This is Hyperium deposits over here. We can see that there are rocks and things here that we could mine more rocks. Um, not particularly interested in that right now though. Okay, so let's keep going out this way. Unknown contact here and we'll fly into this area. Oops. Keep flying you out this way. Controlling time, got it. Hailing ships, yep, yeah, got it, thank you. To build a new ship here so you can have a fleet of ships if you'd like you don't need you can have more than just one um and you can just control them in in real time have them start uh trading and moving to various uh, locations um it's really really neat it's a very cool game i highly recommend it um here we can see that we're flying past these asteroids i'm glad we haven't actually hit anything And we can also, like, rotate the direction that we face in. And we'll, we'll, we'll do that here in just a little bit. Here we can see that our crew are still moving around. Aha. Alright. Okay, so, we're gonna attack you. We've got our shield up. Um, we can attack specific places. I think we want to go for the cockpit. Alright, so we can see that we're doing a little bit of damage here. Um, we are currently taking damage here onto the front of our ship. This is also getting some damage. All right, and now we're taking out the pilot, the cockpit. Come on. Come on. All shield generator. Take a look. We need to be in here. Oh no, we've lost one of our guns. Wait, why are we not... Hmm. Oh, we need to be repairing all of this. Alright, we've got our shield back up. attacking this. We are so close. Hmm. Okay, there we go. Can we start shooting? What a battle. What a battle. Um, okay, well, we eliminated, eliminated the fugitive. We now need to rebuild our ship here. Insufficient resources. Rebuild this as best of your abilities. We need eight. We need wires. We need metal for all of this. Okay. That's fine. Repair all of this. Yes, we've scattered a fair amount of resources just all over the place. Um, here.
I want to mine out all of this. All right, our folks are going to come out here. They're going to grab up all the resources that they can. The build out. Yeah, it's very nice. Oof, that was rough. We'll move our ship over here. Fix this. Okay. And we got, I mean, most of this, most of this ship is in actually fine condition. So that's really good by going for the uh, cockpit. Um, we do take a little bit more damage because we're not clearing out their weapon systems. But now we can fully salvage um, all of their weapons that have not been damaged. Let's go ahead and fix all of this up now. Yeah, I know. If I could get you out here. That's really what needs fixing right now. All right, we can speed up time a little bit. Grabbing up all of the resources that we need for this. Having a little bit of oxygen, then going back out here since I can't really rotate our ship at all. But it seems like they're all making it back, so that's okay. And we're building all of this out, very nice. Holy cow. We lost a ton of stuff here. <laughs> Probably could have had a, a cleaner engagement. Um, and I think I could have been repairing things a little bit more throughout the... Um, throughout that fight. <laughs> to show statistics. Alright. Alright, speed up time a little bit more. Still a few more resources out here, I guess. All right, this thing is rebuilt. All right, we do need more thrusters. All right, build this. Uh oh. Uh oh. This is not good. Alright, there's still a fair amount of resources out here that we can grab. Uh, 
Oh boy, they are really flying close to us here. Alright, and we can actually get up a little bit closer to it now. fix up the shield generator as well. Okay. I think we'll be okay here. We can maybe go get a little bit of steel from somewhere else. Yeah, I don't like the fact that there are yeah, this is... All of this needs a little bit of repair. Alright. Let's go back. Yeah. I'm gonna grab all this. Probably just a traitor. Not go after you. Um, what what is this unknown signal here? What about this one over here? Let's go for this one, and then we'll go back to the fugitive uh, to turn in the fugitive bounty. Uh, an asteroid. And try to avoid that. Okay, and sometimes we can stumble upon other ships. So far, that has not been the case. This is an asteroid field, okay. Upper iron. Megaroid. <laughs> Alright. Avoid the rest of these here. So we know that there's a set of asteroids out here. What do we have here? quickly. Oh. Glad we didn't hit anything there. Another asteroid. Fair amount of asteroids out this way. Alright, let's go back and turn in this quest. We can get a few more, um, 
iron plates and things to fix ourselves up here. And then we'll go find another fugitive bounty to attack. But I really like that there's a little bit more immersion with the uh, the building and the and the fixing up of things. All of that's really really cool. I like the way that it uh, that it operates now. Go ahead and go here. We'll uh, ale you uh, if we want to go trade. Well, uh, first of all, let's um, hail you and then receive payment for this. We also gain fame. Monolith cooperative reputation. Okay. Um, let's go here. And purchase. Did somebody buy them all out? Oh no, they're just not interested in them. Okay, I'll buy 20 or a thousand. I mean, is that a deal? I don't think so. Let's just do 40 of these. Okay. We'll be able to see... Yeah. I'm delivering all the steel here. Okay. Fix all this stuff up here. What else does this thing need? Foils. Fix up these doors. Okay. Okay, and that costs 600. I need what? Uh, some more coils for that. Okay. Repair all. Okay, there we go. Um, we have 4,200 credits left. Let's go ahead and... Maybe I could get a little bit more crew. Edit the ship name. This is going to be the... We'll call it the... Pebble. For now, we'll just call it the Pebble. <clears throat> oh yeah, we can just show the ship interiors here. Um, manage resources, manage crew. We have six out of six here. Okay. So we could... It would be good to have one more weapon, I think. Maybe. Cannon? Energy weapons. Another laser. Mm hmm. Let's just go ahead and put that in here. Just one more weapon. Okay, we just need a few more. A little bit more construction. 
more metal. Oils, there we go. Getting it all delivered. Okay. You might need one more crew quarters back here. Oh, I see. Oh, whoops. Mic there. Um, I think that's good. We still have the one one moment. Let me go ahead and move my portrait maybe over here. I think that should be good. Um, here we can see that we have enough power. We can try to get a little bit more crew, and then we have 19 command points. Alright, let's go ahead and build out the rest of these crew quarters. I think that's good. I think we do need a little bit more crew. Um, and with that, let's go ahead and hail the station, go to crew, and we're gonna hire... Uh, let's go with Durlia, Leader, Durlia. All right, Gemma Zion. Okay. All right, we've got eight folks. Let's wait for them to come over here. Ooh, and we can see that they've got a lot of. A lot of cool stuff here on the inside. I've never seen the insides like that. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, cool. Um, and then lastly, let's go ahead and get another mission. So let's go and do um, this fugitive bounty here. All right, we need to head down this way. All right, off we go. We have a thousand, thousand credits to our name. Unknown contact. All right, now it's moving. I don't think we need to go stop and check it out. I do think we can come over here and see what this is though. Just an asteroid field. Okay. Get out of that. Then we'll come down here and do a little bit of a little bit of a little bit more fighting. And I think with our increased staff, our additional knowledge on how to repair and whatnot, I think we're going to be just fine. This is also... Alright, we can slow things down a little bit more. Alright, everybody's in their stations. All right, we can see them. Their cockpit is over there. I think we're gonna take out their disruptor. All right, let's see how much damage, okay. We can repair. I don't think we need to be repairing quite yet. We need, um... Alright, there we go. Now we're hit hitting the cockpit. And this is just voltage. 
Alright, yeah, we've got our shield up. And we took out the, uh, the pilot, the cock pilot. Or the, yeah, the cockpit. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let's grab that. I don't think we lost too much of our own ship here. I think we actually did a pretty good job. We can go ahead and repair both of those. Fantastic. Alright, we'll send out tr uh, our crew. Okay, there's something else down here, closing in. Um... I mean, we could try to go grab it. Try to fight them. Reactor here. Good, good, good. There's a fair amount of Hyperium here. Great. And then that ship just disappeared on us. A little concerning. Okay. Finish taking this stuff apart. Great. Take all of this apart. Wonderful, wonderful. saying that our storage is too full here. Okay. Um, let's go into storage and build one more here. Okay, cool. Yes, we'll have to adjust this ship a little bit. Inside. Inside. Right, it doesn't seem like we lost too much out here while we were fighting. No, I don't think we need that. Let's just head back. With that, I'm gonna end this episode. Thanks for watching, everyone. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you haven't yet, make sure to hit subscribe and like and all that other great stuff. We've seen some of the construction update uh, here in action, and I really like it. Um, I like the fact that it just sort of, like I said earlier, just adds this layer of immersion um, that just wasn't there before. And uh, I'm excited to keep playing this. I'll see you in the next episode. Thanks for watching.